Hello and welcome. My name is Don Cooper and I'm with PTC and I will be your host for this webinar today. The topic today is going to be using AR to position your teams for success. Let's go ahead and get started. As I mentioned on the previous slide, my name is Don Cooper. My role with the PTC Rockwell Alliance is I'm responsible for the go-to-market. I align with the both sales organizations, PTC and Rockwell. I'm excited to talk to you today about how using AR, augmented reality, can help position your companies for success. I think back to my early days when I was designing and selling hydraulic and pneumatic systems to machine builders like yourself, all the way to where we are today in using augmented reality in these applications. It's very exciting for me to see that progression. In this session today, I'm briefly going to cover the Rockwell PTC Alliance when we announced this in June of 2018. Now when we're moving to some of these macro trends, what we're seeing and how can augmented reality help in this and how can the partnership with PTC and Rock will help you in your business. More importantly, I'm gonna cover with you three overview solutions inside of augmented reality that are coming from PTC. So let's move and get an overview of those solutions. In June of 2018, Rockwell Automation announced a partnership with PTC. What you can see on the screen here is the chairman and CEO of Rockwell Automation, Blake Moret, really excited about this partnership. He was talking about and being quoted here well, around this IT and uh, OT convergence. There's this natural alignment between Rockwell Automation and PTC. Super exciting. And myself being at PTC and being involved in this project all along, we're super excited as well because we're able to take our domain expertise at PTC and help capitalize on this promising technology around industrial IoT and augmented reality. So Jim Hempelman, our president and CEO, is very excited as well. This is more than just a general partnership. It's a technology partnership, a go-to-market partnership, and a co-innovation partnership. Blake now sits on our board here at PTC. Uh, Rockwell's taken an equity position inside of PTC, so we couldn't be more excited about this partnership between Rockwell and PTC. But most importantly, this partnership helps companies like yourself accelerate your digital transformation by bringing PTC technology, Rockwell technology, joint developed technology together to your business to help you gain a competitive advantage. To begin the conversation on using AR to position teams for success, it's important to look at some of the market trends that are driving industrial disruption. If you look at a quote here on the left-hand side from the World Economic Forum, they're talking about the worker shortage. Over 10 million jobs in manufacturing organizations that are going to be going unfilled due to the growing skills gap. The second area from JP Morgan is companies, uh, global manufacturing that are under extreme cost and risk pressures and having the lowest PMI index since 2016 uh, with this deteriorating global exports and business conditions, that's also putting pressure on manufacturers and OEMs. And then this third area of digital disruption by Standard & Poor's, at the current churn rate, about half of today's S&P 500 firms will replace in the next 10 years. You combine all three of these together, what does that mean for manufacturing and those building equipment for manufacturing companies? Those are the pressures that are being put on all of us in this market space. And what I'd like to share with you is how can augmented reality help with these challenges? So before I go into the demonstrations on augmented reality, I want to slow down just for a second and propose something to you that I think is really interesting. And that is the concept that the value chain is changing in the relationship between you as OEMs and the end user community. So while your organization is very focused on driving value-based engineering and a quality product and providing service operations, ultimately then developing, building your product that lands in an end user in the world of Rockwell, the end user community, where that product then gets used, operators operate it, there's an element of maintaining and maintaining that product. The challenge with that is many times there's a disconnected data flow, there's minimal data sharing, and a disconnect from the customer. However, based on those macro trends that I described before, worker shortage, skill shortage, cost pressures, 
uh, end user customers are now pushing further back into the value stream and asking OEMs, machine builders, to provide additional levels of service, additional levels of support, not only just the product they're selling, but now servicing and supporting that product. To support those demands that I previously described, many companies are now looking at making their equipment smart and connected. This helps them tie together with their customers the value chain and really start to understand the end user and how they're using those products. They now have greater visibility into how the equipment's being operated. It gets feedback into live data so that the product management organization can enhance the products. You can push out updates. But it's also giving you the ability to have a greater focus on service, serviceability, maintenance, warranty management, and the ability to maximize your spares and consumables. This all starts with that smart connected machine moving the value chain backwards, providing additional services to your end user customer. This is really one of the building blocks that I'm going to share in a little bit around how augmented reality can actually help with a smart connected machine as well. But I think the value chain is changing. Customers and user customers are now demanding more and more from you as end user customers and OEMs and augmented reality and IoT are here to help. So based on those requirements and those pressures we talked about before, the value chain moving and the macroeconomics, what are OEMs and manufacturing companies doing about these pressure? Well, no surprise, Capgemini did this survey. Many companies are continuing to make the products you've always made, but they're adding an additional service component around it. Maybe it's a remote monitoring service or remote service or maybe even remote support, all of which can be supported by augmented reality. Some companies are actually pivoting, about 18% of them are pivoting to a services only based business. So if you combine the two of them together, most of them are focusing, 72% of the companies are focusing on some level of additional services. And this is where augmented reality comes in to help support adding a new level of service. And that's what I'm gonna cover later on here in this presentation. We did a survey at PTC with our customers that have adopted and are using augmented reality in this OEM space. And we found that the augmented reality is adding value or the use cases and how they're using the technology is in diff these different areas. One is they're using it for design, for design reviews. Uh, in some cases, customers are using it to sell and market. Maybe these machines are so big, they don't want to lug a big CAD file around. They want to show a, a virtual uh, product, uh, and maybe it's a long conveyor line or something. It's easier to take that to a trade show. Uh, they're using augmented reality to teach their operators how to operate uh, once they ship and commission the machine. Uh, many of them are using it uh, for service on how they service, remote field service, uh, and also how they train and train the end operators. And then the other areas in the area of manufacturing, they're using it in the augmented manufacturing or constructions. What I want to talk about in this session is show you some demonstrations on around the service and training component of that. So I'm going to show you that in the next slide. So the way we deliver that augmented reality that I was talking about on the previous slide, those use cases, we deliver it through a product called Vuforia. That's the umbrella brand name. It's a suite of products. We have a first product called Vuforia Chalk, which is the remote assistance and enables anyone to have easy access to remote experts. We then have a second product called Vuforia Studio which is focused on delivering fast time to value for customers who want to leverage that 3D CAD data uh, with IoT and create these 3D work instructions for training and instruction. We also have this product called the Vuforia Expert Capture, which is a procedural guidance tool, facilitates this transfer and sharing of the procedure of an expert to someone that's maybe novice. And then the fourth product we have is uh, Vuforia Engine, which enables and creates a unique AR experience. I'm going to show you the top three in the demonstrations in the next three sessions. The first session on Vuforia will be on Vuforia Chalk. This is a product that allows you to have remote assistance and offer remote assistance for your customers and or to support your field service technicians. So with Vuforia Chalk, it ties right back to those large macro challenges we talked about, having a worker skill gap. Before a chalk allows you to have the ability to take a novice talent 
and quickly connect them with an experienced skill set in the organization. Also, the ability to have uh, addressed the complex workplaces where the technician can service complex products much easier. And as those increased customer demands get pushed to you as an OEM machine builder, uh, this gives you the ability to provide additional levels of service and support to those customers that are demanding more and more from you as an OEM machine builder. So Vuforia Chalk is a very easy to use tool, easily deployed by organizations. It takes an iPhone, you have the ability to roll it out to your organization. It's real-time collaboration with remote assistance, helps you excel accelerate problem resolution so you can dial in an expert very quickly, it empowers your workforce to solve unexpected issues. So maybe you can eliminate a truck roll, helps you reduce the cost of a service technician or sending an expert on site to solve something that could be solved with an over the shoulder type uh, approach. And it ultimately it helps your customers improve uptime operational efficiency, it ties back to that additional service level that end user customers are asking from you as an OEM machine builder. Let me talk to you about how it works on the next slide. So the way Vuforia Chalk works is you can think of it as a live over the shoulder collaboration on either a mobile, a tablet, or a desk type device. It combines live video and audio, but in addition to that, it gives you the ability to have annot annotations where you can mark things up. And this markup is in the real world. It's precise, it has anchors and notations. And then it also gives you the uh, wayfinders to help guide the technician back to where that annotation is. And then the ability of once the collaboration session is over, you can have the ability to document those resolutions, whether it's to support a service ticket or maybe future training. So let's take a look at the product. PTC Vuforia Chalk is an out-of-the-box collaboration app that provides real-time remote assistance. It combines live video, audio, and digital annotations over a shared view to enable improved communication between remote experts and frontline workers. In this video, we'll walk through a short demonstration showing how a remote expert connects with a field technician to help resolve an issue powering a motor. To start, the OEM remote expert who is using Chalk's web-based desktop mode, pictured on the left-hand side of the screen, will generate a connect code using the Chalk host's functionality to invite the customer's field technician to the Chalk call, even though they do not have a Chalk user account. Once connected, the field technician will share their device's view. Using Vuforia's computer vision technology, the field technician will use their phone to map the area creating a 3D environment that will allow annotations to stick to the objects shown in the physical world. As the remote expert and field technician communicate, they will use different colored chalk annotations to highlight specific buttons to press. The direction knob should be turned and point to things that the field technician should pay attention to. As the field technician pans their screen over to the monitor, wayfinding arrows appear to guide the on-site technician back to the specific location of the chalk annotations. Vuforia Chalk's advanced computer vision technology ensures every annotation can be precisely placed and remains right where you left it. This live, over-the-shoulder collaboration will allow the remote expert to walk the field technician through the troubleshooting steps necessary to generate power to the computer monitor and power on the motor solenoids. At the end of each session, the users will have access to a summary session recap which displays points of interest images that were automatically captured when a new chalk annotation was generated. These images can be attached to work orders as evidence of service work or can be used to scale service training for future field technicians. With chalk's real-time collaboration and incredibly accurate annotations, Experts and technicians spend less time resolving issues, increasing operational productivity and efficiency, and improving customer satisfaction. Vuforia Chalk, delivering expert support at scale with AR remote assistance. It's always exciting for me to see that uh, Vuforia Chalk in action. It's exciting for me to see customers that are now using it in the field. What we see and what we're hearing from our customers who have adopted Vuforia Chalk is it's helping them reduce their operational costs by lower travel expenses, uh, decreasing machine downtime for their customers. It's also helping accelerate the training by providing that remote monitoring for new technicians. 
Uh, it's also helping with workforce efficiency, driving that piece, and then increased customer satisfaction. We're hearing that customers are using it as a differentiator in the product offering, the piece of equipment that they're providing to their customers, really as a differentiator on the marketplace. The beautiful thing, and as you can probably tell from that demonstration, it's a very simple tool, but it also is delivering very powerful business outcomes. So it's something for you to think about. At the end of this session, I'm going to offer you a free chalk trial via Rockwell Automation as part of this offer. So stay tuned. One topic I'd like to add onto this with Euphoria Chalk is the question that I get often is how does this tool operate in the plant? Many plants have uh, low bandwidth, not as good of bandwidth as the front office. Inside of Euphoria Chalk, we've commissioned a low bandwidth mode which allows video to be streamed at a high resolution but low front frame rates so that the calls can be effective in very poor connection areas. So if you're thinking about how's that going to work in a plant, we've thought about a low bandwidth option and deployed that in the tool. An additional question that I often receive is customers will ask me if Chalk offers a hands-free mode and I'll tell you that we are in development with that. We are very close to having that delivered. So in the calendar year 2020, PTC will be offering a chalk for hands-free device that gives technicians access so the, they can be working with their hands and have a heads-up display using the RealWare HMT1 headset to have a chalk session. So stay tuned if that's of interest to you. Connect with your Rockwell sales rep and they can help you with that question. The last piece that I'll leave with you on before you chalk is the su session summary. So once you complete a session, you want to save that. You want to automatically bring it back and attach that to a work order and uh, evidence. Many times you get called out on a service work order. You want to have evidence of the completion of the work. That chalk session can be saved off. It also can be reused, can help with training on quality control verify thoroughness on issue resolution. You can scale it in your field service training technicians. Also share feedback up into the design organization, into product design for design improvements, et cetera. Take it back to the office. So that's the summary support session inside of Chalk. Session two I'll cover with you before your studio. This is the ability to take and build 3D work instructions from your CAD data and connect it with IoT smart connected machine data. To explain how Euphoria Studio works, let me start with a concept of physical digital convergence. So if you think of the top part of this yin yang symbol, there's the physical thing or the asset. On the bottom of that symbol is the digital representation. Now, when I first started in industry, it was 2D CAD, but now it's 3D CAD models with simulation data. And for the longest time, we didn't have the ability to, to combine those two with the digital definition and the physical thing once it was manufactured, it went to the field, and we really lost track of what was happening. Well, with smart connected machines and IoT, you could bring that smart, that data, and stream it right back to the digital twin. And with this physical digital convergence, it's all now starting to come to life with Vivoria Studio because we're adding a third element in there. That element is the human interaction. So think about this. You have the physical asset, the digital representation, the data. And now does how does the human interface with that physical digital world? And that's what Vivoria Studio does for you. So continuing on this thread of human, human interaction, so as we have this physical digital transformation, we think a lot around the product and the product definition. The next dimension is around the, the human element and what's happening from a digital transformation for the people, the people interfacing with the machines that you build. How can we help them be more efficient in how they interface with that product? How can we help them in the manufacturing side have to reduce scrap with better work instructions, better understanding of predicting of maintenance or servicing and supporting the assets that you manufacture and build? maybe having better safety and compliance if you're in a highly regulated industry. That's really where augmented reality helps companies in workforce efficiency is bringing the human element in how they participate in this digital transformation. So the way we do this with augmented reality inside of Euphoria Studio 
is we, on the left-hand side, you'll see is we'll extend your CAD data and help you author and publish an AR experience. And then on the right-hand side, what we'll do is we'll give you the ability to view that in a downstream application. So that's where I'm going to walk you through in a demonstration here is the authoring, publishing, and the experience of 3D augmented work instructions. So before I roll into the demonstration of Euphoria Studio, I wanted to just give you a quick overview that it's a, an efficient, scalable uh, augmented reality authoring and publishing tool. It will help boost your workforce safety and performance, can help companies with the assembly, quality, and inspection of the product they're making, also help increase revenue and service satisfaction we talked about earlier, and the ability to offer new service offerings to your customers. I'm going to now walk you into a demonstration and show you uh, the product in action. Today, industrial companies are facing a serious issue around downtime. Industry reports suggest that a single hour can cost between one and five million dollars. At PTC, we are helping our industrial customers reduce downtime through Euphoria Mixed Reality and Augmented Reality Solutions. PTC's Vuforia Studio solution allows customers to easily drag and drop and create a mixed reality experience in hours instead of days or weeks. Using PTC's Vuforia Studio, one of our industrial customers, Howden, was able to easily and quickly create a mixed reality experience. Howden is an original equipment manufacturer. Our products can be found in virtually every air and gas application. If this equipment ever goes offline, it costs a lot of money. Compressor is a critical equipment within the wastewater plant. Plant operators are not typically expert of compressors. Our customers are looking for us for solutions to empower them and how to best service their equipment. Today, Howden is pulling ThingWorks data that's operating on an Azure IoT cloud, and it's overlaying that information in context through mixed reality. We're overlaying the digital twin data on the physical product to show our customers the operating condition and the performance of the equipment. Literally at their fingertip, we can provide 160 years of compressor knowledge. Using Microsoft HoloLens, that customer experience is truly immersive and you get to understand a lot more and it's just a new way of looking at your equipment that you've never had before. With the PTC Vuforia solution and the Microsoft HoloLens together, I think we can really provide a transformative experience for our customers in the industrial market. Wow, that was a great example of how Howden is using Vuforia Studio and augmented reality from PTC to drive and transform their business. So in summary, the value of real-time data with IoT and AR in this case allows the customer to monitor and maintain that service equipment in a whole new way, offering a new service level for their customers. Improve that technician understanding, efficiency, safety when you put a field service technician out of there in the field, Identify potential failures way before they happen, help reduce downtime, reduce costs for the customers, as Hillary was mentioning, has big value in reduced downtime. And ultimately, it allows customers to enable to the equipment uptime for peak performance, helping customers maintain that golden uh, level of performance. The question that I often get asked is, how can I consume that augmented reality experience once we publish it? Well, the beautiful thing is Euphoria Studio gives you the ability to consume it either in a mobile device of your liking, whether it's iOS, Windows, or Android. You can consume it and experience it in a 3D eyewear from Microsoft HoloLens. And in some cases, customers really like to use the 2D eyewear from RealWear or Vuesix. So it's, you can view these experiences on your favorite device. Hopefully this session you were able to think about your products and how you could use Vuforia Studio with your products. What would it mean to your business to have more immersive 3D instructions? What would it mean to have real-time data in context? 
What would it help? Could it help you with virtual product demonstrations and scalable AR content across your business down to your customers? So there's some examples on the screen here of business benefits we see from other customers. But I think what's really important is to think about how can Vuforia Studio help you and what value could it deliver to you and your customers? The final Vuforia product that I'll cover with you today in session three is the Vuforia Expert Capture product. To kick off the Vuforia Expert Capture session, I'll start with a question. Who's used or authored one of these in their lifetime in their career? Now, many of you may be laughing and saying, well, if you've been in engineering and you've been building equipment machines, we all have. And it's interesting because my days of selling hydraulic and pneumatic components to OEMs and equipment builders, this was usually one of the last things that, that was done. You would ship the piece of equipment and then there'd be a scramble and you'd look at the bill of material. What did we build? What did we, what did we configure? And it would put together this uh, final bill of material, this instruction manual that would then ship after the machine would be installed and up to date. What's happening is many organizations are asking for new requirements on how information is being delivered to frontline workers, to the maintenance technicians and the service support organization. And so with Vuforia Expert Capture, we're gonna revolutionize how these work instructions get dis delivered, how they get built, delivered and consumed with what we call procedural guidance. To introduce the product Vuforia Expert Capture, the best way for me to describe it is it's a very fast and easy way to create powerful AR enabled work instructions that empower frontline workers. Think of it as taking what's in the head of an expert and transferring it to the rest of the organization. We at PTC think that uh, Euphoria Expert captures an ideal AR solution for machine builders because it solves a pretty unique challenge that many have. And that is there are cases where there's no pre-existing assets to go create that step-by-step -step instruction that I showed you with Vuforia Studio. Or there might actually be work and training instructions that are either non-existent or there's poor quality. It's in the head of that expert and you need the ability to get it out of that expert into and translate it down the ecosystem. Or the relevant CAD data or documentation of those procedures just aren't available to the organization. And the last area we see high value in this area of expert capture is if you're building equipment that's going to be in a highly regulated industry with very stringent safety and compliance standards where you have to have exact procedures with traceability and auditability. Just like with the other AR products, I'll share just a few use cases with you that we have captured from our customers on how they're using before you expert capture. The first area is in the ability to accelerate the content creation. So the rapid authoring of AR work instructions without pre-existing assets. The second use case is the knowledge transfer. So a template to streamline the formatting and the publishing from that domain expert taken out of the expert's brain, translating it uh, into a documented procedure. The third area we haven't talked a bit about in the other previous ones is the ability to highlight spatial relevance. And this is a unique capability inside of Euphoria Expert Capture that I'm gonna show you in the demo, but the ability to connect those steps in the procedure to specific objects and locations. Key area, you'll see that highlighted in the demonstration here in a little bit. A lot of value in that. And then the fourth area is to effortlessly scale that expertise, whether you're taking it from an expert maybe in one location and you want to capture that knowledge and take it to maybe a, a different manufacturing location or a different part in your existing facility or share with others on best practices. This is another use case that we're seeing that customers are gaining uh, great value out of. So as I move into the explanation of how does before you expert capture work, think of it this way. Creating AR content is as easy as a one, two, three steps. Step one, you capture the expertise. Two, you enhance that expertise. And then three, you scale it or publish it down to be consumed. Now let me go on the next slide. I'll go in a little bit deep, more detail on what does it take to capture, enhance, and scale. And then I'll show you the demonstration. So how does that one, two, three step work that I previously described? Well, it works this way. 
Step number one, capture. You equip your expert with a headwear device, whether it's a HoloLens or a realwear device. You then walk them through the procedure. It's capturing the video, the auditory, the steps, the locations. And then once you capture that, you take that edited file into an editor. And inside that editor, it's just like a device where you would chop a movie or move some music around and you edit that. And you have the ability to bring in other procedures, other documents that you may have in your standard operating procedures. And once you're done with that, you publish it just like any other publisher, like you're going to publish a Word document. But in this case, you actually publish it out to the third component, step number three, and you view it. And you now can consume that, whether you're going to consume it on the device, the realware or the HoloLens or a tablet or device, or maybe even just static documentation. So you capture it, you edit it, and you view it. Euphoria Expert Capture is a new workforce productivity solution from PTC, which captures the tacit knowledge of frontline experts in situ, where and when they do their work and then makes it available to any worker to effectively and efficiently perform that same procedure. Using the Vuforia Capture app on a head-worn device, the subject matter expert can record their work procedures step-by-step step in real time. No tedious written documentation work is required. By using intuitive voice or gesture commands, next step. Ensure voltage selector is on 120 volts. The user can control the recording of the video, take photos, and mark important moments to edit later, all hands-free while they work. The captured knowledge can then be revised and configured in Euphoria's web procedure editor before publishing. Once published, captured instructions are consumed via Euphoria View on a HoloLens, Realware, or mobile device. This gives a clear and immersive first-person perspective of what to do and how to do it best. PTC's Euphoria Expert Capture solution saves your company time and money associated with the creation of traditional training and documentation methods, which ultimately results in significant downstream benefits in areas like quality, safety, and overall workforce productivity. I hope you enjoyed that overview demonstration of Euphoria Expert Capture. It's a relatively newer product inside the PTC portfolio that's gaining, gaining lots of traction. Customers are, are using it in production, getting lots of value from it. Some of the business value that we're seeing from the customers that we're talking to, increase, increased field service uh, productivity and efficiency, and other areas, the ability to commission uh, machines much quicker by reducing the time it takes to set up and commission, reduce training costs, adoption time, the time that it takes to turn over that piece of equipment to the new customers uh, is, is being shrunk. Also meeting those service level agreements, improving customer satisfaction, tying it back to some of those macro drivers I talked about earlier, the customer pressures coming from the end user customers, asking for more documentation in what's being delivered to them. And we're also seeing customers reduced, uh, you know, repeat visits with customers, first time fix rates, reducing those roles uh, by really having this enhanced digital work construction procedural guidance and offering to their customers. The one question I get asked quite often uh, when I'm presenting this is once, once I publish this, how do we consume this? I mentioned it uh, two slides ago on how do you consume it. I'll just hit it one more time. Is you can have the ability to consume this once you author it in either the HoloLens real world device or you can consume it on a phone or a tablet if you don't want to equip all your people with HoloLens or tablets or maybe the use case isn't there. You can even consume it on a desktop or a laptop or many people, or believe it or not, they're publishing it out to a uh, OSHA document or and or some level of service procedures in a Word or a PDF document. But publish it once, consume it across all of these different uh, delivery mechanisms. So over the last 30 minutes, I shared with you several AR products from PTC and Rockwell in the Vuforia product portfolio. I shared with you Vuforia Chalk for remote assistance, Vuforia Studio to publish those AR experiences. 
And then I also shared with you just in this last session before you expert capture and the ability to publish these procedural guidance. I didn't cover with you the Euphoria engine, but that is the application that we embed and resell to other people who want to make their own custom AR applications. Those are the four Euphoria product portfolio tools that are available through the Rockwell PTC partnership. Wow, that was a lot to cover in such a short time on how augmented reality can help position your company for success. Now, some of you may look at those sessions and go, man, I'm not sure if my company can do that or not. But what's interesting is if you look at Tom, what Tom has to say with IDC, and he's published this white paper on how augmented reality helps drive you know, these real world gains in the area of service training and manufacturing. His comment, his quote is, most companies are just getting started with AR and most have few experts on the staff. That's okay. We're seeing that more and more companies are starting to build out this area of augmented reality, IoT, smart connected machines, and they're partnering with key experts like PTC, like Rockwell. If anyone's been to the automation fair with Rockwell, what you're starting to see is more companies are starting to implement augmented reality, IIoT, with the Factory Talk Innovation Suite products in their portfolio. The time is now, and the expertise between PTC and Rockwell can help you build that into your offering. Now, the last piece that I'll leave you with is this offer from Rockwell Automation for a free subscription to Vuforia Chalk. With this COVID-19 outbreak, PTC and Rockwell is offering available free to the user community a subscription of Vuforia Chalk. So if you're interested in getting some of that Vuforia Chalk that I shared with you in session number one, go to the Rockwell landing page and click on Vuforia Chalk. It'll walk you through the guidance of how to get a version of the software, get it up and running, and helping your organization to help your employees be safe and offer remote assistance to your customers and your employees, no charge, free from Rockwell and PTC. So with that, I thank you for your time and attention.